Hi, uh, my name is David Pratt. I'm foreign editor with the Herald and Sunday Herald newspaper and I'm here in Colombia uh, with Ski Off. Um, this afternoon, here in this place called Kuralau, we've been interviewing a series of, of people who've been displaced over a number of years um, as a result of the conflict here. Displaced by guerrillas, by paramilitaries and by the army themselves. We've only been here a very short time but already a picture is beginning to emerge. The more you peel away the layers here in Colombia, the more complicated you begin to realise the, uh, the conflict actually is and the impact of the conflict socially, politically, economically and culturally on the people that are here. Um, I perhaps interviewed as many as half a dozen people over the last hour or so, uh, men and women, and each and every one of them has a series, a litany of horrendous stories to tell of being dispossessed, uh, displaced, um, losing the land, the livelihoods, um, being witness to the most appalling atrocities and human rights violations. Um, among them a woman who always continues to live in fear here um, from a particular paramilitary leader who has threatened to kill her should she make a claim um, for the land that she was uh, kicked off from. But every one of the people that I've spoken to here has really been indelibly scarred by what they've experienced. It's quite obvious talking to them just how traumatised they are, how much they continue to live in fear of the paramilitaries and, and the gunmen here in this part of, of Colombia.